Hi guys, today in this video, I will be making a simple auto cut off battery charger that can charge both lead acid or lithium batteries of any voltage since the output will be adjustable and the best part is it can be operated directly from 220 volts AC. So, I designed the simple circuit diagram for this project. Here at the first part, the AC supply is converted to DC using the bridge rectifier with some capacitors to filter the output current. And here LM317 is used to adjust output voltage using this potentiometer. Since the LM317 only provide maximum 1.5 amperes of current, so I added a PNP transistor to bypass the current up to 10 amperes, while voltage is still applied by LM317. Then it goes to the voltage divider section, for adjusting cutoff threshold. And this relay switches output supply on or off. Also these LEDs indicate battery status full or charging. For easy assembly, I converted schematics into the PCB layout. And the PCB is going to be look like this. You can download both circuit diagram and PCB files, link us in video description. In order to manufacture this PCB, visit jlcpcb.com. And here you can add the Gerber file I provided. After uploading, you can see the preview of the PCB. You can also change quantity and the color of PCBs as per your requirements. And then save to cart for checkout. Within some days I got my order from JLC PCB delivered. And the quality of the PCBs is amazing, and 5 pieces as for just $2. And now it is time to assemble the PCB. So, let's place all the components on the PCB according to the circuit diagram. And after spending some time with the soldering process, I cleaned the PCB with isopropyl alcohol. And here our PCB is looking nice and clean. Now use a good size of heatsink for regulator and transistor. Use heatsink thermal paste for better dissipation of heat. Secure the heatsink at its place using screws. And our circuit is fully ready for testing. Now we need a 12012 step down transformer of 3 to 10 amperes. Connect the wires into the input connector. Now connect the transformer in 220 volts AC supply. As you can see the circuit is powered up. Now use the screwdriver, set the second potentiometer high by rotating in clockwise direction. Now use a multimeter and connect the probes in output connector. As you can see output voltage is maximum 24 volts. Now use screwdriver and rotate first potentiometer clockwise to decrease the voltage, I will set it at 14 volts. Now again rotate the second potentiometer anti-clockwise, till green LED turns on, this will set the cutoff threshold. I used 4mm wire and clips for battery. Connect the wires into the output connector. For first test I used this 12V lead acid battery. Simply connect battery with circuit and press the button to start charging. You will see red LED on that indicates battery is charging.
As you can see the battery is cut off and green LED turned on, that indicates battery is fully charged. In second test, I will use this 12V lithium battery. Simply connect the battery clips and press start button. You can see green LED turned on, means battery is fully charged. If you enjoyed the video give a thumbs up. For more useful videos, subscribe the channel. Also check out these recommended videos. Thanks for watching.